Micro tick routers. That's what I use. Well, I like this stuff. So if you're gonna install one, <clears throat> chances are you probably bought one. This is their website. But if you want to build your own, you have some uh, spare PCs laying around. You want to install it on a machine or a virtual machine even. You're going to want to go over to their website, go to software, go down here, download for your specific package. If it's a ARM based GPU, like say the Raspberry Pi, then you're going to download one of these. I am going to download x86 because that's the one, that's the kind of one that I have. Now there's a couple different options here. Long-term support, stable, testing branch, the development branch. I always get to long-term. Why long-term? Because I want something that's stable. I don't want any experimental code. I want this, the long-term support CD image. So I'm going to click that. Now I'm going to install it. All right, now that it's installed, we will reboot this machine. And that's it. That is installed. The default username and password is, username is admin. Password is empty. Admin. And then the password, leave it blank, and you're logged in. Um, do you want to see the software license? Why not? I will tell you this much, if you do install this on your computer, you do have to buy a license or it, some functions won't work at all. Or And uh, the functions that do work will quit working after a certain amount of days. So what you want to do is go to the Microtech website, sign up an account, which I already have, but I'm not going to log into mine. You will sign up an account and you will purchase a license. You will get the key and they will walk you through this they, that you type in here. It will show you your license. Put it onto their website in a certain spot in their website and it will spit you out another key put here. And once you do that, you're good to go.